What's up, YouTube? My name is Clickwood, and I am back again today bringing you guys another Madden 25 Ultimate Team Pack opening video. And today is the last day that we are going to have all pro packs in, in uh, the game to be bought. So I figured that I would buy as many as I could, which looks like the maximum that you can buy is five. If you saw my video yesterday, you probably know that that's a little bit irritating to me. I want to be able to buy more than five packs if I can. So please, Madden, next year... Please allow me to buy more if I want to. But anyways, with that being said, I want to do this pack opening video for you guys today before the all pro packs are taken out and then we're stuck with just pro packs for the rest of the week, or at least for the rest of the weekend. And so with that being said, I am going to do these pack openings. I'm going to do five regular pro packs and then we are going to do the five all pro packs as well. So that should bring us to like a hundred and what, like 162,000 something in that, in that range uh, of total coins being spent here. So hopefully we are able to pull something pretty decent. Um, I know the Ultimate Legend cards are still in the game, so I'm hoping to get one of those, and we'll see if, if we can get anything that's uh, of any value to crack into that 162,000. But either way, this should be fun. I like the All-Pro Packs. I know a lot of people say that they're ass, but, you know, you still get three gold cards and uh, the opportunity for Legend cards, so it's worth it to me at this point. So, let's get into this pack opening video. We're going to open up the Pro Packs first. So, the first one, here we go, 7,500 coins. And again, guys, we are looking for expensive cards just to try and make our money back if we can. Hey, there's that gold contract extension. I do appreciate those. Uh, not much value. Dominique Raiola is our gold card, so nothing real good here in this pack, unless I missed something, which I don't think I did. So that's pro pack number one down. Number two. Come on. Let's get something epic in this bundle at some point, guys. Let's go backwards. And we get Carson Palmer as our gold card. Brutal. Oh, that's ugly. Nothing of value at all in this entire pack. Moving on now to Pro Pack number three. I really have had not such great of pack luck after opening that Lawrence Taylor. And don't trust me, I'm not complaining, guys. I know. I've gotten well worth my pack opening luck for the entire year. Hey, there's a final edition Aaron, Aaron Williams. Uh, this will probably be the best card that we get in the entire, <laughs> entire bundle, would be my guess. I don't know what this is actually going for right now. Um, I think that goes into the, the Joe Thomas uh, Final Edition collection, so that's, it's probably worth actually something, uh, at least probably close to enough or maybe a little bit more than to get my money back, but like I said, I really have no idea. I haven't paid close attention to what those are going for, so that's a solid card, though. We'll take it. Number four here of our Pro Packs. Okay, CJ Spiller collectible. Not bad. That's decent enough. Send that to our... Uh, current roster and weird the apparently the uh, combine collectibles are back I know you guys are probably watching this video and going obviously they're back they've been tweeting about it all day but I haven't really paid close attention I actually had uh, my wife had her baby shower today her first baby shower so that's kind of what we did today and I really haven't paid close attention to what's actually in packs so that's a little bit surprising to me I wonder what that's going for right now throw that into our current roster and we've got one more pro pack now before we get to our all pro packs. So let's see here what we can pull. All right, stadium. Ah, rookie legend Thurman Thomas. Probably not the best thing to pull, but at least it's a decent card. Um, at least it has a little tiny bit of value anyway. All right, so all pro packs now. We've got five of these that we can open up, so we are going to open up all of them. 25,000 a pop, and the first card is a 70 overall gold card. If this continues like this, I'm going to be an unhappy camper. I need something cool out of these. Hey, another final edition, Julius Thomas. Maybe I will get close to getting all of these final editions and be able to get that Joe Thomas at least. That wouldn't be too bad. Throw that in there to the current roster. Eric Pierce, another combine collectible. And last card, garbage. All right, well... Not a bad pack overall. We did get that Julius Thomas, so I wonder what that's going for. Don't really know off the top of my head. Pro pack number two. Or all pro pack, excuse me. Ryan Broyles, who uh, I, I'm off, I've always been a fan of Ryan Broyles ever since I played the NCAA football games. Another Julio Jones collection collectible there. Malcolm Floyd. 
I wish that he was a good player. I don't understand why he sucks. And an ultimate legend collectible. Oh boy! I, I just, ugh, brutal. Alright, not a good pack there overall. Not good at all. We've still got three more of all pro packs though, so hopefully we can get something decent out of these. Like I said, I really don't know what those final editions are going for, so hopefully it's something. Lawrence Taylor, Rookie Legend. Uh, another awful pack here. Awful, awful, awful. Um, yeah, I, I, I guess these are kind of what all pro packs are. To be honest with you guys, I, I haven't really been much of a pack opener throughout the year, as you guys probably know, but since we're getting close to the end here on Mutt, I figured that... Um, I, I probably should open up some packs so that we can maybe get some cool stuff to give away. But, um, yeah, this is probably why I didn't open up packs very often because I just get I get asked for the most part when I do packs. Um, occasionally I get these epic cards. But, yeah, this is the kind of crap that I normally get, just a bunch of mediocre gold cards that just don't go for anything at all. So, let's see here, guys. I think this is the last all-pro pack, so wish me luck here. Let's hope that we get something epic. And the last pack, because I know a lot of people always say you need to do like some different methods and stuff, so we are going to go backwards through this one. Hopefully we get something epic. I had Deshaun Jackson, Elite card. That's not too bad. I don't think it goes for very much, but... Oh, well, so we didn't really get anything uh, too spectacular. What just happened there? Did I have... Oh, I'm over my current roster limit. Okay, whatever, that's fine. I'll just throw everything to reserves. Not a big deal. Um, but that is going to do it for today's pack opening. Unfortunately, I didn't really get anything too epic. A couple of those final edition cards, I, like I said, I don't think that they go for a ton, but maybe they go for something decent. So hopefully they're, they're the expensive ones out of the collection. I really don't know if they are. I'm guessing probably not. But I'll look it up after this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, with that being said, guys, that is going to do it for the entire video. If you liked it, make sure you press that like button below. Don't forget to leave a comment. And uh, let me know, guys, what are you getting in these all-pro all packs? Because I kind of just got shit on, I think. I don't think I really even made anything close to the 125,000 coins that I spent. So let me know what you guys got. If you got anything cool, leave it down in the comments section below. If you got, like, a link to a picture or something like that on Twitter, that would be cool, too, if you could leave that. But thank you guys for watching, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.